Hi, in this tip we're going to show you how to download and use the image resizer tool for Windows. So let's say you have a bunch of pictures that you took with your smartphone and each one's you know three, four, or five megabytes each and you want to email them. Obviously you're not going to be able to put them all in one email because it's going to be too big to send out or for the other person to receive. So you need an easy way to resize all of them without having to you know use a photo editing program, go into each one and resize and save it and that's where the image resizer for Windows comes into play. So all you have to do is go to this website which we'll have in the video for the link so you don't have to worry about copying that right now and download the program and, and once you download it you just run it and in this case we already have it installed so we're just gonna close but you just go through the next 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 process to install like any other program, pretty simple. And then once you have it installed, when you go to a set of pictures it'll add a Windows Explorer right click menu item so you don't have to actually open the program. So let's say we want to resize all these pictures. They're you know look they're four or five, seven megabytes each. So just either highlight the ones you want or highlight them all. Right click choose resize pictures and then here's where you decide how big you want them to be you know you could pick small medium large or for mobile devices or pick your own resolution there I usually go with large because it still seems to make the pictures you know pretty good size and small enough to where you could email them or use them for other things and um, some of the options here you know for rotation is just you know leave it as it is if you want it to replace the originals check this if you don't then uncheck it and it'll resize them and just make a copy in the same folder so you'll have the originals and the uh, newly sized ones so we're going to just pick large and click on resize and we'll see what the difference is when we're done here as you can see they went from you know four five six seven megabytes to under one megabyte each and they'll still retain a pretty good image quality and look close to the original but just way smaller for emailing so yeah it's just sort of go out to, to that site and download the program install it and give it a shot and you'll find it's uh, very easy to use and it comes in very handy alright thanks for watching